So the actress Christina Milian is juggling a lot. She has three kids, including a new baby born in April, and she's got a new movie, Resort to Love. Earlier, I sat down with her and asked her how she's doing it all. Hi, Hi. you look so beautiful. Hi. It's so good to see you. How are you? Nice to see you too. How do you feel, by the way? You just had a baby Thank a few you. months ago. Oh man, I'm feeling good. I'm on a, I'm like on a high on life. You know, I feel blessed. I, I'm, I was able to work and 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 be, you know, a mom and and I'm in a beautiful place right now. I'm in the south of France right now because my husband's French and this is where we go for the summer. And what? I think I'm, I'm doing pretty good. I'm happy right now. And I got a movie coming out, so I'm excited about that. So let's talk about Resort to Love. It's so funny. Tell us about it, what, oh. what it was like from your perspective. Um, from my perspective, uh, first off, it's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a romantic comedy with a lot of heart. Do you think that Jason is the love of your life? We were together for four and a half years. His feelings don't just go away. You think I left because I chose the job over you, but in reality, I thought you didn't need me. <laughs> I love that there are um, different characters in the movie that are, it's not only about my character, Erica, it's kind of like everybody has to overcome something. Um, so it's kind of like a four-way kind of love triangle <laughs> that's happening. <laughs> um, but I love that I get to sing in the movie. I love that I got to be completely just like, just really comedic and just like let go. And as well as like put some heart into it and cry and have these moments that, you know, connect with real human people that like stories that are, that are are real that are just unexpected and the universe just places us in a spot sometimes in life that we have to like we wonder what why we're there and then somehow it all the answers come you know come come into fruition let's talk about the predicament that your character is in and whether you have ever been in a similar predicament <laughs> Uh, I have been in very similar predicaments as as Erica. Um, as a singer, I think, you know, we all are big dreamers. Like, anybody who wants to be a musician, like, a real artist, I think that the dream comes alive, when, you know, early on. And you're just, like, so made it motivated to make it happen, and you're so driven. And sometimes, you know, it could be a heartbreaking situation, and you sacrifice so much. So I think my character sacrificed certain things, like she sacrificed love to make her dream of, of music coming true because that was her first love and I've definitely put I put myself in her shoes I've been there before um but somehow it all works out in the end um and for her you know she she does the unexpected she goes to be a wedding singer you know a resort singer and ends up singing at a wedding um you know that's something that I haven't done yet before but I've definitely been in situations where I've ended up singing in front of an ex and maybe his new his new boo <laughs> oh gee so meanwhile you you and, and Matt, like, okay, you, you talked about sacrificing love for career at one point, but it seems like, I don't know, you got your priorities readjusted. Am I wrong, right? Where, where think, are we? In this? I think it all, absolutely. I think I got the right one. So all my priorities are all fitting in the right place. <laughs> no sacrifices here. You know what's good is uh, we sacrifice, each, uh, if anything, um, you know, just time from away from, if, even from work, more for family and our situation. And even when I went to shoot this movie in Mauritius, he actually came with me and with our um, with our son Isaiah um, to come film in Mauritius. So, I mean, it is Mauritius. It is a beautiful island. And of course, we did have a family vacation technically, but um, it was also a sacrifice that he made from taking off from, from his his work to be with me. So it's nice. We go back and forth with each other to do that. And I think it really it makes it work for us. I'm wondering, do you, and is, do you still have family in Jersey City? Do you come back to this area at all? I do. Uh, I do have family in Jersey, in Union City, and same thing with Bergen. I still do. At West New York. Yeah. So hi, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Good to see you, and, and congratulations yes, I will come to visit. on everything. Thank you. You're the best. the best. Thank you so much. I'm happy I got to see you again. Me too. Thank wow. you really talking to Christina. She's great. Resort to Love, available now on Netflix.